okay in this video we will make our 3d window to make our 3d window we need ellipses okay because we need to draw a line here right so first take ellipses on you will understand ellipses more you drawing in 3d give x direction and it by direction like this now take rectangle command select this point to this point as you can see it has been created in the face so now what do we do we need to select this polyline move it from here Put some here. Now we'll work here in this. Now we can our uses to avoid to do that. Take uses command again, press enter and enter again. As you can see, it became void. And also, as we draw here, so we can actually make uses here. So we will do actually. If we do not use uses, we might make some mistakes. Okay. So give up set up. Suppose we had a frame of 2.5 inches. Now make a little line inside to give offset about 1.25 both side this and this and, and trim this one line this okay now we we'll copy this entire thing here also in here this one here First, we will make our also we will make these objects as a rectangle. This will be so to do that, just use join command. Now it has been created as a rectangle. Now, first, okay, delete these objects and now copy this. First, we will you draw our frame. So use extrude command. Select that object. Select this object and this object. Displace bar and give it a thickness of three inches. Now we need to delete and subtract this. So use subtract command. Select object. Press enter. Select this object, this object, present. As you can see, our window frame has been created. Now we need to make our glass. We will make this here. So, to do that, take extrude command again, select this, click this, press enter, and give a distance of 1.5 inches. Sorry, we have given 1 feet. So, take extrude command again. Select this, this, this enter 1.5 inches. Yeah. 1.5 inches is little big actually, so we'll use 1 inches actually. Like this, like this, this will have 1 inches. Now we need to put this in here. So now we have to make some layers. The 3D window frame is a color like this. This can also make a layer 3D glass. Like 
make this 3D frame and make this thing called 3D glass. 3D glass. Now we will mix in. Now we will copy this. So to copy this, we go to 3D wireframe. Select, select this object. Select this object. Take copy command. Take this point and put it between the layers. And we will see how it looks inside it. Okay. Now all has been, our window has been created and delete these things. Now we will make some designs in our board windows. So to do that, select, select this command, select loop select any edges and as you can see it automatically detects this loop so accept it and now click on radius we suppose we want 1.2 inches press enter and enter again okay as you can see a little design has been created and also we will do it here so fillet edges command use loop select here automatically detected if it is not automatic, automatically detected then you need to click here on next and next as you can see now accept it automatically radius previous radius it has taken now enter and enter again to can now now our window has been created you can see now we need to put these windows in everywhere so to do that just select our entire window copy it And when we copy and paste, then we will use 3D wireframe to for easier pasting. Actually, copy it, take this midpoint and put it in here, put it in here. Now we need to rotate to use the other sides now so to put the wall cell we need to rotate it for rotating any object either you can select everything and use rotate command or 3d rotate command or uh, here as you can see this is our gizmo tool so as you can see if we select any object like suppose we select it, it shows x y direction so this is our gizmo you can now it has been set to move gizmo like you can move by selecting this axis but if we select rotate gizmo as you can see it changes to like this and here we need we have to select the axis we need to rotate so here we need to so this axis and click here and rotate it like this or make ortho on and rotate it like and need this okay now it has been created now we will put this here and here just select that object now go to wireframe for easier of pasting copy it take the midpoint here and here and we have to now rotate it again Go to wireframe. Go to set it. Sorry, no. We will put this here. As you can see, when I rotate, as we are not using that UCS for these windows, it is floating some under, some over. Oh, this is the main reason we use UCS. If we want UCS, we want to use this here. Then we need to make UCS layer in here. Okay. I think you understand. Now select everything again. Rotate this by this tool like this, and I think this time now go to wireframe again. Select everything, 
copy it select the midpoint and paste it here and here okay. now as you can see now delete this Windows has been created. Now we need doors only. Okay. In next video we will learn how to make doors in 3D. Okay.